Oh, hey, Kickstarter. Hey, achievement unlocked. We hit 23,000. That was stretch goal number one. And now we're moving on to stretch goal number two. And stretch goal number two is a new game called Oh Dear Beta. And when I say new, it's going to be new to our free play Zero and free play CM3 platform. Um, it's developed by a company called Necrosoft. Go check them out. And hey, why don't you check out a trailer of it right now? <laughs> So what do you think? It's a cool game, right? Uh, when I first saw it, I thought that's going to go well on uh, Free Play Zero, Free Play CM3, and I really didn't think much of it, you know, until we started talking to those guys, and they said, "Yeah, you can work on it," and we're working on it. Okay, so we're going to announce a stretch goal, five thousand dollars more. You know, the the first stretch goal is twenty-three thousand. Now this is twenty-eight thousand, and always a big chunk of that money is going towards your rewards of course I mean we're building hardware so a lot of that money needs to go to building the hardware 10 percent five hundred dollars going to the original developer of oh dear beta and you know that leaves what forty five hundred dollars like I said a bunch of that has to go into making your rewards you're getting free play zeros you're getting free play cm3s we gotta pay for the parts right the rest of that stretch goal is going towards me developing oh dear beta for our free play zero and free play cm3 and when i say developing the game already exists i'm porting it over and i'm really excited to work on it to be honest um, i worked on trouble with robots a couple of years ago and that's a really nice game but uh, it's not on our platform so <clears throat> that's what we're working on with that so that's exciting stuff um, the other thing i Figured I'd talk about somebody wrote in today and asked about you know the the CM3 and what we've been working on with that, and I think we really haven't gotten into a lot of detail with that because really we're still working on it. But uh, one of the things I want to talk about is ports on the CM3. The CM3 board itself doesn't really have any ports on it, so we have to break those out for you. And right now, here's kind of the layout we're currently working on. We have the HDMI here and this uh, micro USB here and we're really working hard to I think we're going to widen this out here a little bit and put a full size <clears throat> USB port and then over here we're probably going to have some kind of charging port <clears throat> and I'm not yet sure if that's going to be a, you know another micro USB that's charging only or what but I think that's going to be the layout the other thing that we've been working on is kind of deciding whether we can, is it, there's kind of like a, a fair bit of open space here and we can't really access that with our circuit board because of how the CM3 comes in there. But what we can maybe do that we've been uh, trying to engineer and think about and going back and forth, I think we can make another daughter board and this might be in the form of, when I say might, I, th I really think this is probably going to be in the form of an expansion module that might come later. Um, it's not really part of the base CM3, but I think we're going to try to leave it open for expansion so, so you can have this kind of daughter board that'll sit on there and give you access to a couple things inside of here. Um, and mainly maybe uh, kind of like internal USB ports. So if you had a small Wi-Fi USB, you could kind of have it down in there so it wouldn't protrude and you could still cover it up. Oh, look at that. I started up again while I'm talking. Um, the other thing we could explore is, you know, different expansion cards that would give you like Wi-Fi or Bluetooth built in and that kind of stuff. 
So that's an idea we're working on again, you know, one of these things that we're funding here with this Kickstarter is the development of this CM3. And while that base that base free play CM3 probably isn't going to have those the functionality on it, I think the functionality to expand it is a really cool plan. Um, another thing I, I'm just going to throw out that we're, we're looking into again is uh, we've had some new ideas about how to uh, make silicon buttons for the X and Y. And again, this isn't something that I plan to have for our base model FreePlay Zero or the base model FreePlay CM3. We've announced, you know, in our Kickstarter campaign that these are clicky buttons. That's still what we're sticking with. And I noticed I'm showing you on this. On, uh, on the video, but my buttons don't even have the caps on it right now. I never glued them on. Um, but one of the things we had, we had some new ideas about how we can do silicon buttons. So we're, I just want to throw out that we're exploring it and it could be another add-on in the future.